Life of Ezio is filmed in front of a live studio audience. Except it's not... Get in the van. What? what what's going on? I said get in the van. Oh, oh god. Oh. No. Ah, what a great day it is. Uh, yes, thank you for inviting me to your apartment. Oh, no problem, man. No problem. Can I get you anything? No, I think I'm okay. Ah, yes. Classic, classic. I remember that day. Hang on a second. Something's wrong. What is it? It's quiet. Too quiet. Hmm. Wait a second. I don't smell that. Do you not smell that? Oh, not smell what? The narrator. He's not here. Narrator. Hey, where are you? Where are you, buddy? Where are you? You're down here? No, he's not down here. Uh, is he up here? Uh, no. He's not up here. Oh, is he in here? No. Looks like we got ourselves a problem. The narrator has been captured. What? Captured by who? I don't know. I think we're going to be needing some help for this one. What? Help? From who? The best assassin there is. Well, except for me, of course. Altair. Wait, Ezio, where are you going? No time to explain. Time to go get Altair. Ow. See, what's this? Oh, it's a time machine. I, I totally didn't steal it, obviously. Of course, of course. I'd never steal anything, of course. Okay. Uh, what are we doing with it, exactly? Like I said, we have to go back and get Altair. Well, where is Altair, exactly? Well, he's in Assassin's Creed 1. Right now, it looks like we are in Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. So, we have to go back to Assassin's Creed 1. Well, how do we do that? Well, uh, we have to go back in time. Wasn't that obvious? Oh. Oh, that, that's why you haven't... So basically, this is just a rip-off of a, a Forward to the Present, which is a rip-off of an actually good movie. Yeah, pretty much, yes. Okay, let's go. Alright, here we go. Wait, that's in reverse. Oh, wait. Oh, here we go. Oh, yes, here we are. Medieval times. Well, I didn't know they had dinosaurs in medieval times. Yes, apparently they did. Pretty cool, right? Let's go see if he knows where Altair is. Oh, excuse me, sir. Do you know where Altair is? Rar. Uh, hmm. Maybe there's multiple Altairs. Oh, that could be. Yes, it might be a common name. All right, I'll try his full name. Let's see now. What is it again? Oh, yes. All right. Do you know where Altair who the body of Aladdin is? Rar. Uh, what an idiot. I guess dinosaurs are really uh, stupid. I'm glad you guys died out in medieval times. Alright, what an idiot. Alright, uh, all right, at night, let's get out of here. Uh, Ezio? What? I don't think he liked being called an idiot. Uh, what gave you that idea? Look. Run! Hey Ezio, I think we hit an assassin. Do you think it's all here? Oh no, that's definitely not Altair. That is... Oh no, I know who that is. Oh, we have to get out of here as fast as we can. Before he wakes up. Oh no, this isn't good. Alright, just play natural, okay? Keep it cool. Where is Charles Lee? Wait, wait, wait a second. Hang on. Are you at the auditory? No, I am, uh... I am, uh... I'm Tom Hanks. No, you're not. You're at the auditory. Oh my goodness. I'm such a big fan. You know, the reason I became an assassin is because of you, man. I mean, I loved your games, man. I mean, I played them every single day of my life. I still play them now, man. I mean, wow. I mean, wow, it's such an honor, man. Uh, yes, of course. Uh, it's your fans these days. Uh, anyways, uh, uh, we were wondering if you could help us out. Oh yeah, of course, but uh, only if you could help me out. Uh, fine, fine. What is it? What do you need help with? Well, I'm trying to find Charles Lee so I can kill him. Oh yes, wait, you mean the guy from Hamilton? Exactly. Alright, uh, alright, yo. Well, I guess we can help out with that. It's pretty easy, pretty easy. Pretty easy? I've been searching him for my entire life. 
Oh yes, but you're not Ezio Auditore. You can see Ezio Auditore is very good at tracking people. Well, except for this time when I have to find out anyway. Okay, alright, so... Alright, well, what did you need help with? Oh yes, uh, we do not know how to get back to uh, the medieval times. So we can see uh, Altair. We need to see him. Altair? Wow, I'm a big fan of his too. Uh, sure, I think I can help you with that. Perfect, alright, let's go find Charles Lee. You just stay right there and I'll go get Charles Lee. Hmm, now if I was Charles Lee, where would I be? Hmm. Hmm, the trail seems pretty strong in this direction. I'm going to go this way. Whoa, well, hi there! Oh, who are you? Are you Charles Lee? Oh no, I'm Samuel Adams, man. I make some great beer. Oh, oh really? Oh, hmm. Alright, uh, hmm. So you're not Charles Lee, are you? Nope, no one knows where he is exactly. Alright, uh, hmm. Oh, see, so yeah, I have an idea, alright. Would you mind standing right there? And don't move, don't be afraid of if Connor has a sniper pointed at you, it is totally normal. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Alright, perfect. Uh, let's see, are you sure this is our guy? I mean, he looks like my friend Sam. Oh, yes, that is Charles Lee, believe me, he's disguised as Samuel Adams, yes. Really? That son of a gun, he's trying to trick us, isn't he? Yes, look at him, very menacing, very menacing indeed. Oh, hi, Connor, what's up, man? Don't fall for his lies, secretly he's very menacing. That is, the man you're looking for. Go ahead, take the shot. Alright, if you insist. Hey, uh, Connor, you're not pointing at me, are you? <laughs> very good, Connor, now uh, Charles Lee will not bother you anymore. But if you happen to come across a guy named Charles Lee, you might want to also kill him as well, just in case. Hey, okay, anyways. So how do I get back to the medieval times, back to Assassin's Creed 1? Alright, thank you for the help, Ezio. It's been an honor. Oh yes, it certainly has, it certainly has. Alright, so how do I get to the medieval times now? Alright. All you have to do is get past the first episode of Gmod. Oh no, not that episode. Oh, that was awful. Alright, fine, I'll have to do it. And then after that? After that, you should reach out to here. Thank you very much, Connor. You know, you're not as bad as people say. No, you're so pretty bad. Okay, see you later. <laughs> Synchronized. Oh, oops, my bad. Uh, I'm sure you'll be fine. <laughs> Alright, hey guys, what's going on? This is Spacer, and welcome to the very first episode of Gary's Mod. Oh yeah, dudes. Uh, look at this idiot. Who does he think he is? I mean, wow, what an idiot. Alright, I'm gonna go, go take care of him real quick, alright? Uh, are you sure that's a good idea, Ezio? I mean, he's the kind of the creator of the series. No, I'm sure the series will be better off without them. I'll be the new creator, okay. Whoa, Ezio Auditori, is that you? Oh yes, of course it is me. Wow, I had an idea for an episode with you. Episode 8 would be called like Assassin's Greed. Oh yes, that is very nice, very nice. You know what I think? Oh what? That's what I think. You, you missed. Were you, were you aiming for me? Oh no, I was aiming for that bird over there, but now that you mention it... What, do you have abs of steel? There we go, okay, fine. There we go, perfect. Now that that idiot's out of the way, let's move on. Uh, Ezio, are you sure it's not gonna have any negative effect on the series? No, of course not. The series is better off without them, like I said. Before. Now, come on, let's go. Alright, here we are. Masyav. So beautiful. Wow. Uh, how are we gonna find him exactly? Oh, leave that to me. I have my eagle's vision. I will use that. Yes. Let's see here. Which setting is the eagle vision setting? Let's see. No, that is drunk vision. Let's see. Uh, party vision? No. No. Ah, uh, here it is. All right. Let's see. I don't see him anywhere. Hmm. Uh, maybe he's in the bathroom. Let's see. It's got to be here somewhere. Let's see. I'm right here. Oh. Oh, I'll say here. Nice to see you. Uh, you look a little different than I remember. Yeah, we couldn't get the rights to my outfit, so we had to use this Dishonored thing. Oh. Well, wait, why do you have an American accent? I mean, America wasn't even discovered yet. Maybe by the Vikings, but not by you. Uh... The ball, I guess, the same reason why I can't swim. Oh, fair enough, fair enough, okay. Alright, so what is it that you need from me exactly? I mean, you wouldn't be here for nothing. Oh yes, well, the problem is, you see, we had a narrator for the show, but he was kidnapped. And now we need to find him. The problem is, there's no clues left behind, except for maybe some clues that we didn't look at before. Alright, well, let's go. Alright, now we have to go back to the future. By the future, I mean Renaissance Italy. It's you, are you sure you know how to drive this thing? Of course I know how to drive this thing. 
Ah, let's see what we got. Ah, what? Well, here we are, back in the future. Oh yes. Do you see anything on the air? Hmm. <laughs> Wait. See something. Red fabric. And I smell... Communism. That could only mean one thing. He's in Cuba. Ah uh, yes, Cuba. Wow, it looks different from the last time I've been here. Wait, is when was the last time you've been here? A night? Uh, well, never, but that's besides the point. I see. Ah. Uh, hey, it's you. Stop up here. Okay, I'll tell you. Look up there. That man. Oh uh, yes, I see him. He's a Templar. And look, there's a narrator. We have to go up there and save him. There's a lot of stairs. Uh, what level are we on exactly? Ezio, we're only on the first floor. Mamma mia. <laughs> I did not. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. Well, well, well. Ezio Auditore. And Altair. Wow. A and Arkham Knight. Not surprised to see you, actually. But, yeah. Welcome. You finally found me. After what? Five million years? You're exaggerating. It was only four million. Uh, 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 no, no, who cares? Alright, anyways. What do you want with the narrator? He was only a tool to get to you. Wait, wh why didn't you just capture me instead of him? Oh. Uh. I didn't think about that. Uh. uh well, no matter, anyways. You're here, anyway, so it doesn't matter. And why exactly do you want me? Well, you see, all of the Templars hate me. No one respects me. I figured if I kill Ezio Auditori, the most famous assassin, no offense, I'll say, that I would become the Grand Master. But the only thing you're becoming is the Grand Master of Death. Wait, wait, before you shoot me. We have to end this properly. I was thinking the exact same thing. Dance battle. That Ezio. Oh, oh yes, that's right. I just did that. No, his moves are too good. No. Ah, Benny, all in a day's work, eh, Altair? Yes, yes, it was. Thank you for the help. Without you, I don't think we would have been able to find the narrator. Oh yes, thanks for saving me, guys. Ah. So what do we do now? I think I have an idea. Ah oh, yes, fantastic idea. Oh yes. Oh, just a second, I just realized something. We could have just gone back and stopped the narrator from being captured by that guy. I mean, why didn't we do that? Son of a...